नमस्ते वेलकम बैक टू अवर चैनल क्यूबिट एजुकेशनल सर्विसेस आई एम प्राणेश द फाउंडर ऑफ द चैनल एंड एन आई आई सी बैंगलोर एमएस टूडे आई सर एप्टीट्यूड टेस्ट ट्वेंटी ट्वेंटी थ्री रिजल्ट हैव बीन अनाउंस्ड यू कैन चेक योर रैंक ऑन द ऑफिशियल वेबसाइट इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू टेल यू वॉट रैंक विल फैच यू द सीट इन विच इंस्टीट्यूट इफ यू रिमेंबर बिफोर द एग्जाम आई वॉज टेलिंग यू that only the rank matters well the marks that you have got they of course decide your rank but number of seats and rank that's the main comparison okay so without wasting any further time let's dig deeper into this firstly now all of you are going to be scientists or physicists or chemists or mathematicians so whatever work that you do it is very much essential to quote the reference okay and for today's video the reference that i have chosen is uh, the 2022 cut off list and usually the ranks they do not vary much for every year all right so that is my reference i have already stated the reference that i have used secondly most of you might already be knowing uh, and many of you have also messaged me that the channel actually helped them a lot in physics and mathematics so if you are going to repeat or if your juniors are going to prepare for iser aptitude test and nest please send share our channel's link to them that will be of great help to you bit okay now for 2023 specifically iis and iit madras have also announced that they are going to admit students through iser aptitude test but because there is no data available and considering the reputation of these institutes my prediction is that for general category if your all india rank in iser aptitude test 2023 is less than 200 then you will get a seat in iisc or iit madras but this is my personal prediction okay now uh, round 1 cut off marks for the previous year for general category of course the opening category rank is 1 and the closing rank is a bit higher 1000 see this is only for your reference this means if your category rank is in between this range you are very likely to get a seat in the first round okay now uh, which iser you will get that is unspecified according to this uh, data but as we see sub- successive uh, rounds cut offs you will realize what rank will fetch you which seat okay so obc 1 to 1000 OBC NCL fifteen to five twenty two, SC three to two seventy four, ST one to one thirty one, EWS opening rank was five and the closing category rank was one seventy nine. That means if you are trying to get a seat through EWS quota in first round, if your rank is somewhere closer to one sixty to one ninety, you are very likely to get a seat right in your first round. But that also depends on your preference. Okay, round two. Again, for general category, it is one sixty three to one five four one. OBC NCL it is one twenty to seven forty two. If you find your your rank in this range, you can expect to get an ISR, whatever choice that you put in the second round. Okay, SC seventy six to two to three seventy nine, ST forty six to one eighty three, EWS thirty eight to two forty nine. Okay, uh, same is the case for round three. institute wise cut offs are not available for previous year according to official source uh, for round 3 the opening category rank was 283 and the closing category rank was 1719 obc ncl 258793 sc 99387 st 53183 and ews 782275 so i think the cl- closing category rank for ews is always well it's always very Well, it's close, right? Okay. Now let's go to round four, and from round four onwards, we have institute-wise rank cutoffs available. Okay. So this is uh, round number four, twenty twenty-two. Okay. First of all, look at the first row. This is the ISR-wide opening and closing rank and the category. Okay. This is ISR-wide, so right from all ISRs. Okay, Pune to Bharatpur. So in round four, the Vaisar Bhopal opened at one three six two for economic sciences, closed at one seven nine one. Engineering sciences four sixty three one four double nine, and then there are other 
ISRs. You can clearly see that Pune stands out. Okay, Pune, then Tiruvananthapuram, and Kolkata. Okay, so you can say these are the three top ranked ISRs according to uh, this particular data set for general category. Okay, you can also go to EWS now. Okay, for EWS, the opening rank was 78 and the closing rank was 336. And you can compare the numbers, you can pause the video and compare the numbers for yourself. Okay, uh, these are the ISRs, uh, whatever ISR you are aiming at. Then select your category, take a look at the category. There are opening and closing ranks. If your, uh, if your rank lies well within that particular range, you can think of obtaining a seat or getting a seat in that particular ISR. Now let us go to round 5. Okay, let us go to round 5. Now as the rank, the magnitude of the rank increases, the significance of the later round also increases. Okay, so for round 5, ISR wide open category cutoff was 322 opening rank and 2000 closing rank. Same thing for other categories. Now, if you if you look at ISR Pune, this blank space here indicates that there were no, uh, I think there were no seats available. Okay, all of them were fulfilled. And for EWS, the open close, there is nothing displayed there. So, in right on fourth round, everything was uh, fulfilled. But uh, for general category, there still are 322, 357. So, there isn't much variation for ISR Pune. 283, 319. 322 to 357 okay uh, for ISR Kolkata however opening rank was 360 in round 5 but the closing rank was 740 this might be because of the students cancelling their ISR seat and getting to into IITs or NITs but those variables will always be there okay uh, let's go to round 6 in round 6 the opening rank was 362 the closing rank was 2349 now you keep on seeing this uh, low opening rank that's probably because the students kept their uh, uh, their preference on the float float option and they waited for the higher round uh, subsequent rounds to get the answer of their choice and perhaps they got it in these subsequent rounds let's say round five or four okay 283 322 362 okay fine for answer Pune, there is still some hope for general if you're from general category if round six uh, a student with all India rank of 534 had also got Asar Pune and there is only one course in Asar Pune, BSMS on like Asar Bhopal. Okay, so if, if your rank is somewhere between 400 and 500 or till 550, you can still hope to get Asar Pune in round 6 and there are other category ranks which you can check. Okay, same thing with round 7, no seats available in Asar Pune and others which we can, we can see the ranks are also increasing so again i'm repeating if you find your rank in that particular range in your category okay then just pause the video uh, take a look and then you can decide okay same thing with round eight all four digit ranks are there for op opening and closing Yes. Now, in, pre, in uh, for the previous year's admission process, there were around 12 rounds. Okay, but if you go to the uh, PDFs of rounds 11 and 12, only ISR Bairampur was vacant or seats in ISR Bairampur were available for admission. And that might also be the case again because students cancelled, they got might be a good college in, let's say, and a good engineering branch uh, through their local state CT or through JE Main. There are multiple reasons for that, uh, and of course, those factors are not in our hands. Okay, so what does what you should do now is go uh, sit back, watch the video, pause whenever you want, and take a note which what answers you are aiming for, what is your category, and make a note of it, and then you can think of floating or freezing your priorities. Okay, well, that's it, it was a short video. If you have any queries, you can mail me on this or info at the red I wish you all the best. And okay, I'll also put a PDF of around 9 to 12 cutoffs. I will include that in this presentation. I'll put the link in the video description. Uh, thank you for watching. And if you are still not subscribed to our channel, then please do that. All the best.